Alright, today's the fifth. I'm down here doing the walk on. I, mean, I just come up to this little area here, I mean, with all those fish in there. Like, ton of. Look at all that. A lot of carp there. A lot of silver carp or grass carp or something. Right. I'm arrowhead hunting. I'm looking for shards of pottery. A guy I know said he found a nice little uh, pile of busted up stuff down here the other day. So, all right, I'm hunting around. I've been here before. So, all right, see what we can find. It's all tough. All right, today's uh, August 5th, and. I'm digging out this bank right here, and you see we got some fucking uh, some bone fragments here. This could be human. Uh, here's the first piece uh, of pottery I found right here. I just found this one just a few seconds ago. You can see that's got some pretty good designs on there. So, all right. So we'll clean them up and uh, get a better look at it when I get to home. Let's we'll see what else I can dig out of here. All right, I'm gonna be here for a little bit. All right, it's not all tough. All right, here's some of the stuff I got yesterday. And, uh, odd ends I picked up over the past few weeks of beach coming. Can't go metal detecting due to the drought, so. Nice little glass stopper there. There's a clad dime I eyeballed on, on the beach. Two wheat pennies I spotted. I'm not sure of the dates, but they are definitely wheats. There's enough enough there to see that. So get the macro going. Said. But definitely wheats. I'm gonna have to do some electrolysis or something to try to clean them up. fragments here. I'm not sure if these are animals or these could be uh, human remains. Not sure yet. I haven't found anything that looks like skull plate or nothing like that, but These all come out of where, uh, where I found the pottery, so they're all coming out of the same area. Here's a, a couple of smaller little bits. on that one there. That was a pretty good little find here. Looks like this one had been patched when they made it. You can see it right there. You can see the little pattern pressed into it here. has to be my favorite piece here I found and you can see that here's the top edge right here you can see all the multiple indentations there where they designed it and you can almost see the little finger marks there too, the rub marks when they were making it. And I found that one it, digging out too. It's either a real good flake or, or 
part of a, a scraper or something maybe I'm not really sure but it come out of the same area where the where I was working all the pottery so See about going back again, and uh, might get some more stuff again today. We'll see. All right. Thanks for watching. It's all tough.